and welcome to the vlog. It is currently Wednesday afternoon. I just got out of the shower. I'm currently plopping my hair in a t-shirt, which is why it looks a little messy, but it's okay. But it's actually like th after three o'clock already. I've been pretty busy today and we just got new doors installed. So now we have all new, well, mostly new windows. I think we had one that was older and then we just got all new doors. Well, sliding doors anyway for the patio. And I didn't do that much today. I did get my laundry done, <laughs> so that was good. My laundry was all done before two o'clock, which normally takes me the entire day because I get distracted with literally everything. But I don't have any any major plans today. I do have um, a youth leader meeting later this evening, so I'll be doing that in person because I'm kind of burnt out on Zoom, to be honest with you. I've been a little burnt out on Zoom calls lately, so I've been really slacking, but feeling a little better because now we're going to be able to do in-person things and we're discussing our plan to go in-person. So yeah, I don't have too many plans today besides that. I was going to work out this morning, but I was just like way too tired and it was a little loud in here. So I decided not to. So I'll do that tonight most likely. Just do like a lightweight workout. Maybe do, well, can't really walk unless I go to the gym. So because by the time I get back, it's going to be dark update it is a little while later i just took my hair out of the plot which it looks a little bit crazy but that's fine it'll look a little bit wild for a little while until it dries better but i will link the tiktok down below that i want that i watched of a girl who showed how to do it on tiktok i forget her username i'll put it down here though and she actually goes through like step by step how to plot properly and it's been really really helpful as well because my hair does not look like this most days and it actually looks really good so I'll link everything in the description box and soon once I get more comfortable with everything then I will post I'll do a hair care like a hair routine but right now I still have no idea what I'm doing so we're gonna leave it at that but in a little bit I'm probably I'm gonna get ready to go to youth it's right at about 4 45 so it's not I don't have to worry about it for another like 30 40 minutes or so but I'm actually getting ready to edit the last vlog. I'm watching Kit Boga because he's really, really funny. He, If you're not familiar with Kit Boga, he is a scam baiter. So he calls scammers using different characters and things like that. I forget which character he's doing today, but I'll link his Twitch and his YouTube down below because he's very entertaining. He is family friendly himself, but the scammers are not sometimes. There's one guy, Steve, I'll link that video down below too. He gets aggressive. <laughs> It's to the point that like if you keep it on a normal volume, turn your volume down for that one because he gets really loud and he curses a lot. So just an FYI for that one, but I will link that in the description box too because that is funny. <laughs> so I'll link him in the description box, but I'm going to get back to editing for a little bit, my phone charge, and then I'm going to be heading to youth. So it is the next day. It's Thursday afternoon. I didn't vlog after I got back from youth last night, but basically I just relaxed, watched my friend Ica's stream, which his link will be in the, his Twitch channel, and YouTube will both be in the description box below. But I was watching him play some Among Us, which has been my latest game addiction that's not The Sims. And I unfortunately couldn't play last night because I play on my phone, and I was didn't have the update till today, so I was actually just playing some today. Today I didn't do too much. I had lunch, which was really good. I had ravioli and breadsticks from Publix, so I just had that leftovers from last night. And I've just been watching streams and playing some Among Us. I'm getting ready to go live on Twitch right now, which if you saw my last vlog, um, I go behind the scenes and kind of show you what my setup looks like when I stream and what I stream, which my schedule, I'll post my Twitch schedule down below. The times vary week to week, so there's no like set times, but usually it's, I start between 5 and 7 p.m. Eastern time and then go somewhere between 8 and 8 p.m. and midnight Eastern time, so... It all depends on what my plans are. Sunday afternoons are my early days, so I normally stream about 2 p.m. to 6 p.m., depending on what my week looks like. This past Sunday, though, I streamed late at night, so sometimes I will, but it depends. But today's been pretty chill. Like I said I'm getting ready to go live on Twitch. Um, today's Throwback Thursday, so I'll be playing Backyard Soccer MLS Edition, which is an older game from, I think, like 2000, but it runs on my computer, so that's all I really care about today. And yeah, that was pretty much it guys it is saturday i actually ended up not vlogging at all yesterday 
but I was I was kind of productive. I was taking a little bit of a lazy day, so I didn't get that much done. I did the dishes and I went to Publix. But today's Saturday. I'm getting ready to go live with some Sims 4, which is of course my favorite game right now <laughs> to stream. And today I'll be furnishing a shell and playing my Schultz Legacy with my Gen D Sim, Dimitri. So we're gonna see if we can find him a girl, hopefully soon, because I think he's getting close to becoming an adult and so he doesn't have very much time left to do it. But yeah, I just did my hair, just washed my face and stuff like that. Hopefully this, all of this craziness clears up fairly soon. I just bought some new stuff yesterday, so hopefully that'll help clear it. I don't actually know. But yeah, I'm gonna get to, get to streaming. And I will see you afterwards. Before I go live, I figured I'd show you something out of Publix yesterday. I bought these really cool Celsius packets. So when I was at a, um, when I was getting pizza last week, I grabbed a can of the raspberry acai, and it was really really good. And I hear Alicia Murray and Ashley Nicole talking about it all the time on their vlogs, and I see them drinking them all the time. So I figured they've got to be pretty good because drink wise, I feel like we have kind of similar tastes. And so I found these packets at Publix. They were $15 and there's 14 packets in it. And this is the berry flavor. Of course, I took the, the uh, top of the box off last night. But I tried, I tried one and they're really, really good. It says one packet is one can. So it's like I bought 14 cans for $15 yesterday, but I didn't. And I've just been using them in my small blender bottle so I put some ice in it I have 16 ounces of water and then one packet of the celsius and it turned out really really good it smells like cherry jello but it tastes like cherry like it does not taste like it's you know healthy or like nor like natural like it tastes really really good so I recommend checking them out so this is the berry flavor and it looks it shows raspberry and blueberries but it tastes like cherry to me so I don't know but it's really good and I recommend trying them out because one packet is one can and the cans are really good don't get me wrong the cans are amazing but this is also a good deal if you're at the grocery store but if you're at the convenience store definitely get a can they're super good so guys i hope you enjoyed that vlog i'm sorry it's kind of a little bit all over the place but like i said in there i will link everything that i mentioned in the description box below and try to i'll also try to find a link for the celsius packets they're super good i've been drinking one a, I've been drinking one a day for the last couple days and it's been really really tasty because it breaks up the monotony of just having water and tea and stuff like that so anyway guys I hope you have an amazing day and if you like this video please give it a thumbs up and go ahead and subscribe down below and I'll be back with more vlogs and I'll see you later